Hello, hello, and welcome back to Leaky Gaming, and welcome back to the Ravenport, and welcome back to FS19. <clears throat> now, we're buying uh, Einbach Pneumatic Star. No. Let's buy the bigger one. Let's buy the bigger one. This is going to be... Yes. Uh, this previous um, weeder... <clears throat> I wanted to buy is actually interesting really really interesting piece of machinery because it can see the canola and in one of our special specializations uh, concerning uh, making a farm specialized for a specific thing um, this will be perfect if we go for a canola uh, we're probably gonna do that in one of the, uh, let's say, I think um, some of the maps like uh, Shamrock Valley for Ireland. We can be a canola farmer, even though I don't know if that would be um, a specific thing for Ireland, uh, because there's not many crops you can actually plant, seed there, cultivate. Um, yeah, so, but the, the, I think we're gonna um, explore that idea. Anyway, we have field 21 here. I'm gonna start to unfold this one. And, uh, yeah, it's not a small field. It's not the biggest one either. And we're gonna do first time ever weeding. I'm not sure if we can do it now or not. They say something about growth stage, but there's nothing on this field. The field has been uh, cultivated, plowed, I believe. Right. So let's check it out. Uh, turn it on. No, it actually works automatically. And let's check it. The first. There we go. Okay. So, so what does Wither do? <clears throat> Wither uh, pulls out the weed from the ground and leaves it rotting in the sun and all like the readers do it's like uh, you know pulls it out of the ground breaks it uh, uh, does its own thing you know just destroys the weed pulls the whole plant out now why are you able to do the weeding um, during the uh, during the stage that the uh, first growth stage when the plant is really young usually when the plant go out of the ground um, we the, the homo sapiens the humans uh, design the plants to be like that uh, that they grow directly upwards you know to get the most of the sun and the whole nature thingy you know to enjoy the most fruitful life so we can harvest it goodness and crops or whatever yeah so uh, this one uh, pulls the whole weed out of the ground and just leaves it there on the field which damages the plant and in the most cases actually it just dies the, the weed um, but it definitely helps or even maybe uh, at least it like even postpones the um, uh, damage that is being done to the wheat because uh, to the crops like uh, wheat or barley or whatever we have and like, in this case it's gonna be Soybeans, yes. Well, oh, by the way, we're planting soybeans. Uh, yeah, so I had an option to spray these, but I decided to go against it because uh, this cute little machine actually allows me to um, remove the weeds, hopefully for the whole duration of the growth of the plant. Still not sure. Uh, still need to see how the game mechanics work con uh, concerning this because it might be that um, if you pull out the weeds now it has a certain period during the day when it grows so you know giants they can actually make it like kind of circular if perpetual and at the same time during the day weeds grows maybe not maybe yes we'll explore the option but anyway uh, if we remove it before the harvest does it mean that it's gonna appear just after the harvest uh, that we, uh, before seeding uh, does it mean it's gonna be it's gonna appear after the harvest hopefully but we don't know we're gonna test it now we'll see 
Anyway, uh, we have all our fields ready. Uh, we in the last episode we harvested the oats. We only got the three thousand two hundred and fifty something liters of oats. Uh, we still have the straw on the field, and I'm not really sure what we're gonna do with it. We might actually just keep it. I'm, I'm not sure because uh, we need to buy more pigs, and I'm kind of I want to buy more pigs. Uh, yeah. Uh, we're gonna wait for the big harvests of those fields. One of them is gonna be a really hard one. It's a sugar beet one. So sugar beets is gonna be a big one. Um, we should earn a lot of money, like compared to the other crops, but we should earn some a bit more money during the sugar beet uh, harvest. And I think I'm gonna keep all those sugar beets. I noticed that pigs eat a lot here in the base game and even sugar beet wise so it's gonna hmm, maybe we're gonna need more sugar beets and i don't want to plant sugar beets that often i want to return this equipment we have and at the moment we're just gonna pile up the sugar beets we have and we're just gonna leave them uh, lying around the farm it's eh, nothing should happen to them anyway yeah that being said um I think the the palleting or boxing potatoes and sugar beets, the mod we had in uh, FS17 spoiled me and I don't want to box them now, sugar beets, you know, uh, to sell them off if I'm not going to get the double the price and hopefully, um, hopefully the Frontier designer will come up with the uh, FS19 mod for selling the box sugar beets and potatoes for more money. That would be really, really convenient. I would really like that. Especially when we start our great, great farm. We'll see which one still. Uh, on which map. Uh, we're gonna make definitely, at one point, sugar beet farm. Of course, that sh it's not gonna be 100% sugar beet. And I'm now <laughs> trying to aim to do this whole field, whole width of the field in one last go. I don't wanna miss left or right side. I don't wanna repeat this weeding session yeah come on come on we can do this we can do this looks like we're gonna do it and yes at least visually all the weeds removed right next stop uh planting soybeans yes why soybeans we have one uh, field of corn and we have one field of soybeans. Now the corn is much more fruitful than soybeans. And my main concern is selling it. Selling too much of uh, each one of them. So what I want to do, I want to sell uh, similar amounts. Because if we have a lot of corn, then it's going to be an issue with us um, uh, selling it. The price is going to be too high. Ooh, you know what? Maybe we should... Nah, I'm just gonna leave it like this. So, we're gonna turn it on. I, I want it to go uh, diagonally or horizontally. Uh, I want it to go east to west, but west to east, or well, east to west. Um, but no, it's fine. Well, maybe we should do the bridge marketing. Yes, okay, let's do this. Right, so yeah, uh, soybeans are less fruitful than corn. Corn is more fruitful, so I wanna do the corn. A bit more uh sorry soybeans a bit more so we will have similar amounts we have two trailers even though i think the amount of corn we have at the moment is gonna fit in one trailer load i would still like to do uh, uh more soybeans and they are actually a bit more expensive per ton Here we go. Okay, we're making some progress. Uh, we are seeding uh, soybeans here. And yeah, uh, sooner or later it's gonna come... The harvest time is gonna come and we're gonna make a hefty profit out of this field. Well, I do hope so. Uh, Right. 
Uh, this one here. Lower. Let's go. Yes, so soybeans. Uh, as I said, we are reenacting the millennium far millennial farmer. Uh, you know, Zach Johnson. Uh, we gonna do mostly John Deere equipment and we're gonna do soybeans and corn. Okay, he doesn't have any animals, but we're gonna try to do hogs just so we can explore the animal type in FS19. Uh, they don't have any uh, animals uh, in their farm in Minnesota. But we're gonna try to do as best as we can with whatever Giants has given us. Right. So, yeah, we're sticking to beans and the corn. And the hogs, of course. Uh, the, yeah, sugar beets, unfortunately, that's something we have to do because of the pigs. Also, we no, we have enough uh, wheat, barley, uh, oat. Uh, we had to do a quick experiment with the oat. Actually, I think oat was required as a mission in the beginning uh, for us to plant, but we're fine. Right. We'll see what other uh, missions we can do for our neighboring farmers, and I definitely would like to um, explore the option of uh, us having um, our own equipment and doing the fields. I'm not really sure how uh, reasonable it would be for us to do uh, the biggest fields, like field 8, I believe. Yes, field 8 is the biggest one. Um, with our little equipment, but uh, we certainly will try. <laughs> we might not, definitely, we will not gonna try with uh, our John Deere harvester. Uh, well, maybe we can actually. I'm, I'm thinking about it. Uh, until we are waiting for another map, um, first modded map, um, I'm cheering for. I don't know, there are a couple of them coming in. So currently I'm cheering for the, not cheering, but uh, old Slovenian map, old, uh, old Slovenian farm. I would like to do that one because I never did it in FS17 and I think it should be the smaller size map. So it would definitely help us a lot um, using the smaller uh, equipment, especially the older ones, Central Eastern European, especially Fourth Street, Fiat maybe attractors and all that good stuff you know starting out small and uh, oh maybe even okay it's technically you wouldn't find in slovenia you wouldn't find a lot of roasted marsh harvesters but i'm thinking about roasted marsh as well the new the small roasted marsh the nova i would really like to use that harvester right how far are we gone We're just under half Right, uh, also guys, I've been playing a multiplayer recently, uh, there's a really nice dedicated server um, with the hard work, we, uh, the guys are starting off really, really small, and uh, we are building up the whole farm, it's also in the Ravens, Ravensport, Ravenport, sorry, and uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna be doing some um, time-lapsing on that map as well so that should be interesting hopefully you guys are gonna like that time lapsing plus the some a little bit of commentary maybe some some uh, discord chat that we're gonna be using uh we'll see if anything interesting happens but uh, in the next couple of weeks you can expect the start of the multiplayer uh then also the the um the, the channel I really like to watch, uh, he expressed the desire, he would like to play multiplayer also, hopefully uh, he will join or we're gonna make some multiplayer episodes together, that would be really really nice. Uh, guys, the ultimate thing about this game is the multiplayer, you know, doing all this stuff that you did alone uh, is now doing it together with your friends, with, well, with YouTubers, with... Uh, anybody you know just enjoy I, I really like it even the smallest equipment in the map let's see <laughs> two meter plow and take the huge field and just plow it you have a little chat you have you're doing something productive you're helping your farm and um, it all counts in the end you know it's all fun and you know good time so hopefully you guys uh, will join us the, the 
multiplayer uh, community as well, and uh, we can be one big happy family. <laughs> uh, all jokes aside, but yeah, the guys, if you have opportunity, by any means, try to join the um, multiplayer, especially when you have a really nice um, server with a lot of guys who are who, who are not afraid to roll up their sleeves and uh, you know dig in on the hard work. Uh, it all actually it's really really fun. Right, so we have here seating of the field 21. Yes, 21. So uh, soon. Oh, uh, actually, I think we're two thirds done already. Okay. Right, so we used, we didn't use that much seeds at all. I'm surprised by that. Let's see. Um, fertilizer is not falling so fast. Seeds are falling a bit faster than fertilizer, but it's all in all really well. We have more than enough uh, boat, so we're gonna be grand. Right, so next field we're gonna do. Uh, let's just check this for a second. Okay, auto save. We have field 23 that is not seeded. We might do that off screen. I'm probably gonna do corn in that one. And we're gonna switch fields between corn and soybeans. So we're gonna have at the moment, uh, we have two soybeans. Two bigger ones are soybeans, but that's okay because they are actually. Uh, less yielding than the corn fields. Corn is going to be there's a lot of corn. Uh, so yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm uh, happy about that. We'll see if any of those need plowing or uh, uh, after the harvest or any other work. But uh, as it seems, we're going to stick to this plan. Okay, <clears throat> few more passes and we're done for today. Okay, so there you go guys, you see, it's not that complicated and it doesn't take a lot of time. This whole episode, us weeding and seeding corn, I did like two minute, three minute preparation for this episode, just brought all the stuff next to the field. It doesn't take a long time to do proper job and do that like once a day on a daily basis, even with the smaller equipment doesn't make a lot of difference you know it's still all good old-fashioned fun <laughs> uh, that's a I, I don't mind doing even with the smaller equipment and I actually want to start doing that but unfortunately anytime I get I try to record something for you guys something for the community and um, try to do some research and some videos you're gonna see in the uh, near future uh, some new experiments I did. Um, yeah, it's all. Uh, I, I would really like to. <laughs> I would really like to uh, take a lot of a long, long time and just start from the scratch, like all of it. Even get like one harvester and just do harvesting until my eyes pop out and just like in, enjoy the game to the fullest slow as possible um, yeah I actually might do, no, it seems, sounds really really interesting just do it slowly and do it properly and uh, take my time in development I might actually do that and just uh, I'm gonna have to choose a map for that like map I'm gonna stick until to uh, FS21 I'm probably not gonna record any of that it's just gonna be for my own uh, sake and um, okay, let's see here. Uh, 
yeah guys that's it i hope you enjoyed this episode nine miles it oh seeds plants pretty fast yeah guys hope you enjoyed this one there you go let's check it out okay let's uh turn it off let's fold it away i love this machine this is a really good uh, uh this is a really good uh, machine yeah. anyway guys i hope you enjoyed this one fertilize 50 percent we're gonna do some fertilizing spraying on this one uh no weeds hopefully we're not gonna have any weed issues uh this harvest season but yeah guys press the like button subscribe leave a nice or a nasty comment in the comment section and i see you tomorrow bye bye